Have you ever wondered how a country could stand as a living museum with a culture and history so rich that it transcends the passage of time? We invite you to join us on a journey to Ethiopia, a remarkable land that effortlessly bridges the gap between the old and the new, the ancient and the contemporary. Situated in the cradle of the Horn of Africa, Ethiopia is a testament to the steady march of history and the enduring strength of its people's spirit. This enthralling nation is one of the oldest in the world, its history reaching back to times immemorial. It's a place where the sands of time have not erased the markings of its glorious past, but have instead allowed them to grow deeper, more profound. Its roots puncture the very heart of history, drawing up the lifeblood of times gone by to nourish present. Its rich tapestry of cultures and traditions gives it a distinctive identity that is firmly grounded yet never static. Every corner of Ethiopia hums with stories of a bygone era, legends and myths that continue to shape the nation's identity. To walk its streets is to step into a living narrative that unfolds with every step. Each monument, each landmark, and every face tells a story of heritage, resilience, and progress. The people of Ethiopia don't just remember their past, they live it, breathe it, and carry it forward with them into the future. They are the living embodiment of their country's remarkable journey, nurturing its legacy as they hand it down from one generation to the next. This is a place where the past is not simply remembered, but is lived each day. The story of Ethiopia is inscribed in ancient rock-hewn churches, whispered in the winds that sweep across the relics of Aksum, and echoed in the pulsating rhythms of traditional music. This land holds a rich tapestry of history, woven with tales of resilience, continuity, and a civilization steeped in tradition. The Kingdom of Aksum, an influential power in the first millennium CE, left a lasting imprint on the landscape with towering obelisks and ancient tombs. These enduring symbols witnessed the rise and fall of empires, weathered centuries of change, and bear testament to a past profound and influential. With every stone, every artifact, and every echo, Ethiopia's past whispers to the present, a constant reminder of its indomitable spirit. These stone giants are not mere relics of the past, but living monuments that continue to narrate the tales of a bygone era. In this land, spirituality is not just a concept, but a reality that permeates every aspect of life. From the humblest hut to the grandest palace, it is woven into the very fabric of existence, coloring every sunrise and sunset with hues of the divine. Dominating the spiritual landscape is the Ethiopian Orthodox Church, an institution whose history reaches back to the dawn of Christianity itself. As one of the oldest Christian institutions in the world, it has meticulously preserved traditions that stretch back to the 4th century. Nestled in the rugged highlands, you will find the rock-hewn churches of Lalibela, a testament to the resilience and ingenuity of Ethiopian faith. Often referred to as the eighth wonder of the world, these awe-inspiring structures were painstakingly carved out of solid rock by generations of devoted craftsmen. These architectural marvels are not merely historical monuments, they still serve as active places worship, their vaulted chambers echoing with ancient hymns and prayers. Their walls resonate with the spiritual fervor of countless worshipers, creating an atmosphere of sanctity that continues to draw believers from far and wide. Carved out of solid rock, these architectural marvels continue to serve as places of worship, echoing with ancient hymns and prayers. Yet, Ethiopia's cultural richness extends beyond its historical landmarks. This profound cultural diversity is a testament to the country's varied history and its geographical location, cradled between different civilizations. It finds expression in an astonishingly vibrant tapestry from the traditions of over 80 ethnic groups. Each group, in its unique individuality, brings a different thread to the tableau, adding to the rich cultural heritage of the nation. Their customs, languages, and folklore are distinct, providing a fascinating insight into the heterogeneous Ethiopian society. Prominent among these are the Amharas, known for their mescal celebration, a centuries-old tradition involving bonfires and processions. The Oromoziricha festival is another significant cultural event, marking the end of the rainy season with singing, dancing, and feasting. Then there's the Hamar's bull jumping ceremony, an initiation rite that tests bravery and endurance. 
These are just glimpses into the spectrum of unique cultural practices across Ethiopia. Such diverse cultural practices add color to the Ethiopian landscape, making it a melting pot of traditions and cultures. They serve as a testament to Ethiopia's enduring cultural richness. They are the lifeblood of Ethiopia's societal fabric, providing a vibrant backdrop against which the story of this unique nation unfolds. Each tradition, each language, each cultural practice serves as a thread in the rich tapestry that is modern Ethiopia. The heartbeat of Ethiopia is also felt in its traditional music and dance. This vibrancy is most vividly displayed through the enchanting sounds of its native instruments and the pulsating rhythm of its folk dances. Tracing back to Ethiopia's historical roots, these cultural expressions have been handed down from ancient generations, preserving the country's rich heritage. One cannot help but be mesmerized by the unique sounds of the Masenko and Krar, traditional Ethiopian instruments. These instruments are not just tools for creating music, but they are the sonic narrators of stories, experiences, and emotions of the Ethiopian people. They fill the air with profound melodies that resonate with the nation's soul, creating a harmonious symphony that echoes the rhythm of life in Ethiopia. As the music starts to play, the Ethiopians dance the askista. This distinctive dance, known for its complex shoulder movements, is not an ordinary dance. It's a captivating sight, a dance that captures the essence of Ethiopian joy and resilience. The askista, with its energy and rhythm, is a physical embodiment of the Ethiopian spirit. It encapsulates the courage, the strength, and the vibrant energy of this African nation's people. The dance is a visual representation of how the Ethiopian people embrace life with passion, pride, and unwavering spirit, making every shoulder movement count. The askista, a distinctive Ethiopian dance known for its complex shoulder movements, is a captivating sight that embodies the spirit of the Ethiopian people. Ethiopia's story is also one of culinary delight. This is not just a tale of its remarkable history and vibrant culture, but it also unfolds the country's culinary adventures. One can't talk about Ethiopian cuisine without mentioning injera, a sourdough flatbread. It's a daily bread, quite literally, and forms the foundation of most meals, its unique texture and taste making it a culinary delight. Then there is Dora Wat, which is a spicy chicken stew. Its sumptuous blend of flavors and the delicate balance of spices make it a popular choice and a true representative of the country's richly flavored cuisine. Ethiopia's culinary landscape, however, extends beyond these two dishes. From Kitfo, a delicacy of raw minced meat, to the vegetarian-friendly Shiro Wat, the choices are limitless. Every dish in tells a story, a story of tradition, community, and an enduring culinary heritage that has been passed down through generations. The traditional coffee ceremony is a central part of this narrative. More than just a caffeine fix, it's a cherished ritual, a symbol of hospitality and community. It is a testament to Ethiopia's claim as the birthplace of coffee. This ceremony, which can last for hours, is a time for friends and family to come together, share stories, and enjoy the rich flavors that Ethiopian coffee has to offer. So, Ethiopia's story is not just about its history, its people, or its stunning landscapes. It's also a journey for the taste buds, a gastronomic adventure that leaves a lasting impression. This journey through Ethiopia's culture and history reveals a land where the past and present coexist, where ancient traditions breathe life into the modern world. A place carved by nature's hand, etched with the imprints of ancient civilizations and a resilient people. A country painted with the brush strokes of breathtaking landscapes and vivid diverse cultures. Our exploration took us into the heart of Aksum, a place where ancient civilization whispered its stories through the wind. We witnessed the enduring faith etched in the rock-hewn churches of Lalibela, a testament to time. We celebrated the rich tapestry of cultures, their dances and music adding rhythm to our journey. We tasted the distinct flavors of Ethiopian cuisine, each bite a story, each flavor a chapter. Through all these experiences, we discovered that Ethiopia's story isn't written in history books alone. It pulses in the heartbeats of its people, echoes in the of its monuments, dances in its music, and lingers in the taste of its cuisine. Ethiopia isn't just a country, it's a timeless tale that continues to unfold.